Hello, how's it going? This is Dead Knight Leo. Thank you for being here. I appreciate it. Don't forget, if you're new here, subscribe to the channel, like, and share. And don't forget to comment too. I almost forgot about that. I was like, hey, wait a second, wait a second. What, what am I missing? Missing the comment section. Don't forget about the comment section. Give it some love. Anyway, um, so here's the deal. I am trying to be as stealthy as possible with this build. It's it's my bit. Like I love being stealthy when I play Survivor. And today I'm going to show you if it works out or not. Well, as you can already tell. This is not going this is not going already as planned. Like it's already off the poor start. And my strategy is already failing me too. Look at that. That that's a poor button use right there. So anyway, we're gonna jump right into it because now we have no chance to think about it. Dredge just came right up. I was like, oh I got like a few more seconds to say something, you know, cool and witty for the introduction. No, the dredge just went like fuck it. I'm right here. <laughs> we're getting started, bitches. <laughs> See? Dude, what is it, like 30 seconds in and he's already downing somebody? Jesus. Oh my god. I'm not gonna lie, I did enjoy the Halloween special. Too bad I, my computer went on the fritz for like the rest of the entire month. I only had like five days of Halloween and that was that was it. Like I got no chance to keep playing the game throughout the month. So all of October I was out. Like I had no computer. I was, I was so pissed. I, I was like, my PC, no! You know, and... So, for a whole entire month, just PC-less, which meant no Dead by Daylight for Halloween gameplays. I, I, I hate that. I hate it so much. I hate it so much. Uh, you know, on another note, I, I've been noticing that I sound like I have a runny nose. I don't know if it's because of my accent or it's because I have a deviated septum and, and I have like, you know, a bit of a stuffy nose that way. I, I hope to correct that. I'm hoping to correct that. <laughs> That's incredible. I, I don't know if it's my nose that is like ma making me sound like I am, you know, having this like stuffy nose problem. But it, 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 I never noticed that before. Now I feel more obligated to try and sound like, you know, like I don't have a cold 24/7. Will it work? I don't know. I don't know. Let me know in the comments if you've been watching my videos and progressively seeing the the difference in the way I sound in my voice. It also makes for you know. Fixing this chance a little more bearable because these are 90 seconds that if I had no comment it would just be taking forever, and I, <laughs> I don't know that people are just willing to like sit there and watch, uh, you know, a DVD character just like fix a gen at no like at no added added speed for 90 seconds straight. So that just that's just me though. I, I don't think anybody would do that. Oh look, a flashlight, but I'm not down with I, I'm not down with the flashlight. I suck at using a flashlight. That's why I'm not down with it. I suck at it. I'm a horrible flashlight user, so I just don't bother with it. I also know that most of the people who play this game don't really fix gens. Like, they love to do the chase, they love to do the, you know, the, the taunting and the bullying, but they don't... They're like, they don't, they don't really fix the gens, and it's an important part of the game. <laughs> Which is a little bit funny too, it's like the most important part of the game for a survivor is actually fixing gens. But <laughs> it has been switched around so much because the game has evolved, there is no way to say that it hasn't. But the game has evolved so much that now like just fixing gens it becomes like... Like it's a, it's a priority but I want to say like it's a second priority next to be getting chased and actually like, you know, outsmarting the killer. That, that's my <laughs> that's my take on that. It was like I feel as though like uh, we have gone away from the idea of you know like fixing the gens and making so, making it so that the killer uh, prevents you like really prevents you from you know fixing the gens and it's more about like oh no it's a killer so let me loop the killer let me taunt the killer let me like bully the killer as much as I can so they just end up giving up. And they either disconnect or just like stop playing all together, so they just like rush the gens all at once. Uh, <laughs> I might be just wrong on that, but for the most part, whenever I play solo queue, I, I just see it that way. It's like most people are just playing for the sake of taunting killers, <laughs> and half the time it just doesn't work. Half the time it just doesn't work, and ah. Uh, uh. And the thing is also like. When it comes to gen, especially like uh, gen repair, like it, it's 
There's only so many perks. Like, I, I think there's like a few perks that actually help you with gen rushing. You know, to just facilitate the process of like fixing gens. And I can see why, because uh, you know there are four survivors, and if all four survivors were to just like get the exact same perk for fixing gens at a at a faster rate, like <laughs> say for instance, um, you get like four survivors that have no miter, uh, they have tenacity, and then they have resilience. All four of them, like, and then just you only need you only need one, but but for the sake of <laughs> For the sake of making this a problem, just like, imagine that at least two of them have proved thyself. Oh dear god, like, can you imagine? Can you imagine that freaking boost? Like, okay, the resilience gives you a 9% boost on anything that you do. Uh, that's including um, gen repair. So, that's insane. Prove thyself, uh, basically, I think it gives like each person who's working on the gen, as long as they're working on the same gen together, uh, I think it gives them like, an extra 15% speed boost. So basically, like if you are the one holding proof thyself and somebody comes with you, then both of you get 15%. So that's a 30% overall. Like that's a total of 30% freaking gen rushes, uh, you know, speed right there. On top of the 9%. So that's uh, <laughs> that's literally like with the two of them combined is 48%, nearly 50%. That like. Oh dear God! So like that's fifty percent, nearly. It's forty-eight percent. So then, it's if for some odd reason, say like all four uh, survivors were to like get together on one gen, then that means it's, it's nearly one hundred percent. It's ninety-six percent. So oh dude, like it is insane. So a, a a gen rush like would take like what like ten seconds. So I can see why. Like I can see why. Like you know. Like, gen rushing is not a thing. Uh, in comparison to, like, chasing. Also, like, it's not nearly as fun. It's not nearly as fun. Um, <laughs> that's just the reality of things. Like, gen, like, gen repairs as a whole, like, it's not nearly as fun as, like, getting chased and, you know, getting spooked by a killer. That's just, that's just how the game is. And look at me getting... Trying to be stealthy is not working out for me in this game. But then again, it's a freaking dredge, man. The dredge is... T oh, God. Like, dredge is a... Uh, it's a top tier killer in my book. Like, it's a, it's up there with the nurse. You know that, that freaking nightfall ability is so lethal. Like, just blinds the entire map. You can't see anything, but he can definitely see you. <laughs> like, he can definitely see you. It's like what? Like how? How do you have that much power? That's right, White. I saved you. Now it's your turn to save me. Like, why is it that nobody runs like a better heal? Like, oh, there he comes, there he comes, oh, oh god. And I ran out of haste and endurance, so... He knows, you know? <laughs> He's like, oh, he knows. I, I, I barely made that vault in time. That's right, he loved, he loved. <laughs> he knows. I was like, oh, crap. Like, this dude right here knew. Alright, getting, getting this freaking pumpkin right here. A lot of people didn't actually kick the pumpkin. I did. I did. I was like, screw this. I want that pumpkin. And I was like, I want that freaking little extra experience so I can actually get some um, some value out of this. Because why not? <laughs> Alright, so we finally did it. We finally did it. We got all five gens on the dredge. Uh, I only got one hook, so that's it's not terrible, you know. So considering the the fact that like he actually can catch you, like, and, and the crazy part is like he doesn't need like a whole crazy ass field of vision. Like, he doesn't need auto reading. Like he can just like take advantage of his special ability and teleport just about anywhere, and then his own um, like. Auto detection, which is not really auto detection, it's more like, you know, presence or whatever. It's a technicality, basically. Uh, it doesn't work on distortion, so he can see me. <laughs> he knows where I'm at on the map. <laughs> like, damn it. But still. I'm not gonna lie, though, that freaking Nightfall is, is, is a great way to catch, like, some, you know, like, oblivious survivors like me, because the thing is. 
I had no idea where I was. I was like, I know the door is here somewhere, but it's so dark I can't see. Like, I can only see what's in front of me. So, I don't know where to, like, I don't know where to go. I didn't know where to go. I was like, wait, where, where is... <laughs> where is the damn exit? <laughs> and then I realized, like, oh, it's on the other side. I was like, if I had opened the door, he would have come running because he knew that that door was open. Like, or, like the door was on the on the process being open, so he would have come running and he would have definitely caught me. And the idea here is not to be even seen until it's too late. So what did I find in its place? What did I find instead of the freaking <laughs> the door? I found a hatch. That's right. I found a, I found the hatch in the high ground. <laughs> I have the high ground. <laughs> oh, good old Obi Wan Kenobi always has it right. And I'm out. <laughs> oh, good game, good game. Managed to escape on the last second using the hatch. That's good. That's good. That's a good escape. That's a, that was a good game. That was a good game. All things considered, though. <laughs> All things considered, because it was against the dredge. He could have easily caught me, though. Ah, oh, good hatch. That's a good hatch escape. Look at all the points that I just made. God, look, look at that point gap. That score is so high. <laughs> and I mostly, what did I do? Like, just fix gents, right? Like, that's all I did. I barely got chased at all. <laughs> Which is great. <laughs> I'm not complaining. I love the fact that I barely got chased at all. Look at that background. That's a, that's the reason I actually just left that. I, I intentionally left that there because I just enjoy that background so much. It looks so cool. Why can't Dead by Daylight make, make more backgrounds like this? It looks amazing. I love it. I love it. I love this like orange design. <laughs> All right, we got Midwitch now, which is another like survivor friendly map. Like I don't know a lot of killers that love this map. I play killers, so I know I don't like this map. Um, even with killers that benefit from it, like Sadako, and even the nurse benefits from playing in, in Midwitch, I, I still don't like playing with this map a lot. Like, in fact, I, I think it's so obnoxious. <laughs> like, in reality, I think this map is very obnoxious. Oh, hey, we got a Wesker and a pumpkin. There we go. Bam! In the face, pumpkin. In the face. That's right. You became my bitch, you pumpkin. <laughs> oh, that's so dumb. Ooh, this guy running corrupt intervention already. Like I swear to God, like, like if you're running corrupt intervention, your intention is literally to win. Like you're you're coming here with the intention of being like, you know, toxic and and destroy everybody's good time. <laughs> like you're not you're not in it for for the fun. You're in it to win it. Like there are some people out there who are like, yeah, I'm here to play the game, but I'm not here to have fun. I'm here to win. Like literally have the W. That's what I want. I want to win. <laughs> Damn. And it's like, I respect that, I respect that. Which it makes it that much more satisfying when I actually beat them at the, <laughs> at the game they want to win. It's like, oh, I know you wanted to win, but you lost. It's like, sorry, I took your W. Sorry. It's my W now. <laughs> oh, seriously, this is the God Gen right here. The one in the very center of it all, the God Gen. Like, no joke. Yeah, it's like if you get that gen, you practically have the game guaranteed to win. Like it's hard not to win when you have that gen, because like basically it's like it's the ultimate bait. So you can escape the ultimate bait for killers, <laughs> then you definitely can win it. And look at this guy. Look at this Wesker. He has no idea. He has no idea. He would have had a clue if I didn't have lightweight though, for sure. If I didn't have lightweight, just like scattering the scratches and just making him disappear like five seconds sooner. Then he would have definitely known where I'm at. <laughs> also, I may I may not have spine chill, but I'm pretty good at detecting. So I'm like, the second I hear that heartbeat, I'm like, okay, like he's coming, he's coming. And even then, like you get like you get a different announcement too, which is the music. You know the killer music that they they play like right before this the the heartbeats are played. Like when when you hear that, you're like, uh, is he coming? Is he coming? And because I already know Wesker's music so well, like I already know it so well, it's like oh I know he's like, like on the verge. If I hear that, if I hear the music coming, I, I just run away. Because if I just wait a little longer, if I wait for the first heartbeat to start like you know sounding off, it's already too late. Because Wesker is so fast, like his movement speed, just his basic movement speed is ridiculously fast. Look look look, like 
a little just a little extra steps right here and look he thinks I'm in the locker he thinks I'm in the locker he's like I can see you but you can't see me bitch and even if you could see me with the aura reading the store should takes care of that problem it's like uh uh no no 10 seconds of absolute no aura presence sorry bud you can't see me but he's so determined though like he's determined to just get that freaking center gen like he's camping the gen <laughs> he's camping the gen more than he's trying to get survivors just look look how far we went through the game and he hasn't actually hooked anybody basically because he hasn't been able to like detect anybody and also because he's just obsessed with the center gen and the thing is like one gen already went off so we got one gen down center gen is popping off and here he comes again like and she stayed like she made a mistake you like she stayed that's a terrible mistake to make right there and there <laughs> like she's waiting for the she's waiting for the right time and by the time you you hear the the moment the moment of truth where it's like oh like oh Wesker is right here. It's too late. He's already right behind you. And see, see, see what I mean? He's <laughs> already knocking your ass down. Oh, oh, Wesker, why, why are you so fast? <laughs> why are you so fast? Like you got like Legion speed on normal. Like you don't trigger special abilities, and you are like moving so fast. God, like, how does he do that? Like I, it's cool. I get, I guess, because I play him. But like, as a survivor, I'm like, it is such a freaking extreme disadvantage. And we still manage to outplay him sometimes. Like we still manage to win. Like why am I going back and forth? You may ask, because I know the dude is camping. <laughs> I can hear the damn thing music. <laughs> Dude's literally camping. See? <laughs> and he still missed me. Uh uh bitch! No! No no no! No you don't! No you don't! Uh uh! No! No no no! Oh he got me! He got me! That knife also has a strong ass hitbox I swear! It, like... It has a very long range! I still don't understand why I could not get the freaking... Uh, was that that? Oh I was in between books! Oh that's why I couldn't get the pallet! I was in between books! That's why he got me! You little bastard! I hit the pallet button. <laughs> I I tried to drop the pallet, but like I was standing in front of books and not the pallet. Jesus! Oh, and it's just that's weak. That's weak. And then he is not tunneling me. Okay, cool, cool. He's not tunneling me. I thought he was, but he went, he were um he he were <laughs> he was he was busy doing something else. Okay, let's use this med kit now. Let's make good use of it. Try to get that uh, great skill check, so I can get some 3% um, additional speed. No, I uh, no, no, that's the wrong atom. That's actually the gloves. This one is actually the right atom. It's just an an additional 5% speed. So we're good. We're good. But my man is determined, and just a little speed up process, cause you know, you know, like I said, nobody really wants to sit there and watch. Somebody just do a gen with no like additional added speed for like 90 seconds or however however many seconds was this was because uh, I didn't finish it and it was already uh, at a head start so I think it might have been like eh, 55 seconds <laughs> maybe maybe okay now we got another gen down so we got two gens down and that's the ultimate hiding spot for a freaking survivor <laughs> Screw the lockers, screw the bushes, it's right in between a bed and a desk. <laughs> I promise you, the killer barely ever sees you that way. That's right, that's right, take the pallet stone. I'm, get I'm getting my revenge from what you did to me on the second floor. <laughs> like, you, you technically won by a technicality. <laughs> I was like, I stood in front of a book, therefore I could not drop the pallet on your face. That's the only reason why. <laughs> Alright, so I really want to help this guy out. You know, because we, we're like... And then he sees me, he ditches me. What? What? Like, uh, what's... Am I cursed? Like, why did you leave? We could have just, like, 
rush this gen and then be done with it. There you go. You came back. Thank God. There you go. Let's do this, buddy. Yeah. Well done. Now we got three gens down. And this Wesker must be losing his mind. He's probably he's probably thinking to himself like, I know I got her. Like, I know I hooked her. And then I know I chased her. What happened? Where is she? And now, and now, we can finally do the God Gen in peace. There's a God Palette and then there's a God Gen. This is the God Gen. Damn it! Ah, I spoke way too soon. Okay. Okay, well, it's not terrible. It's not terrible. I mean, that god gen is total bait, but still. The fact is, we got now four gens down, so we're good. We're good. But, oh god, like, this Wesker is just so persistent. Yeah, give me that pumpkin. Yeah! Oh. 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 Uh. Yeah. I... Tr <laughs> I played myself. I played myself on that one. <laughs> Damn, pumpkin. I mean, I got some nice experience points, or like, rift points, or whatever those things are. <laughs> oh, it's like energy points, right? Like, I think that's what they are, energy points. Like I said, I only played this for five days before my computer broke down on me. So, um, I don't, I don't remember what they really are. Alright, lady, come on, let me heal you up. Uh, it's, it's too bad that, like, we, we cannot run, like, an additional perk, or, like, some, like, optional perk that you can switch in between. Because <clears throat> I would totally be running by the bullet. Like, I will totally be running by the bullet, like, every time I heal somebody, like, they'll be automatically silent, so the killer will not know what the fuck, like, oh, and not once that we get the god gen, not once that we get the god gen, and look, look where we are, <laughs> and then I get a flash, I get a flashbang, so we're good, we're good, we're, we're on the verge of finishing in this, finishing, finishing this, finishing this, what, what I say? <laughs> I'm like, because I feel a little bit of relief, that's why. Oh, dude, no! No! He got him. He got the... He was a good dude. I mean, like, he, he came in and... He did most of the gen. I came in and tried to help. He walked out and he, he came back to do the last 10 seconds of the gen. But this is what gets me. It's like, that killer, he knows. He knows. He knows, like... He knows the rest of us are walking. So he's not like dude the the face camping is so hard. That face camping is ridiculous. You're not getting anywhere near him. Oh you did! You did! Oh my god, he actually What? And I got assist points just for being there. I got participation points just for being there? Oh god, he got him again. And there is no saving him now, damn it. Damn it! Ah, that sucks. That sucks. He got him again. I, I still don't even... I didn't freaking aim the camera to see what happened, but like, most of the time, like, it's damn near impossible to get somebody off the hook when you're in that narrow space. That's incredible. Look at my score. Look at my score. That's so sad. That's so sad. I mean, I still beat the Wesker, so I guess, like, you know, by what, like... No, I didn't. I didn't beat the Wesker. <laughs> Damn it. Damn it. A low score. Oh well.